Hello and welcome back to my channel, Chrissy Love. I'm Chrissy and this is where I talk about perfumes. Perfume reviews, first sniffs, new releases. Top to bottom, we are all about perfumes here and I post videos twice a week. Now today I am doing a review of Dolly Parton's new perfume. It is called Scent From Above. And if you don't know who Dolly Parton is, I'm not sure where you've been for the last 30 years or so, but she's a prolific and legendary country superstar. She's a singer, she's a songwriter, she has written thousands of songs. Uh, she's also known as a humanitarian. She also is most recently known for contributing $1 million to build the vaccine for COVID, the Moderna vaccine. So you may also have heard about her that way. So this new perfume of hers was released in 2021, but you actually can't get a full bottle of it yet. You can only order samples. And I got my sample on Scent Beauty, and this is what it looks like, the little mini size. And I've been wearing it nonstop for the past two days. This is not a first sniff review. This is a real tried and true review. So I'm super excited to tell you more about this perfume, but let's start with the scent notes. So the top notes are pear, black currant, mandarin orange, and peony. The middle notes are jasmine, vanilla orchid, and lily of the valley. And the base notes are amber, musk, tonka bean, sandalwood, fir, and patchouli. And what's really interesting about this scent is supposedly this is what Dolly actually smells like. So she says on her website, Having my own perfume has always been a dream of mine. For as long as I can remember, people have commented on my scent. What are you wearing? What is that fantastic smell and where can I get it? Are all questions I have heard daily for more years than I can remember. The truth is I have been blending my own scent for years. It's a combination of bath oils, powder, and perfumes that have become my signature and is known everywhere I go. It's time for me to share this with you. I hope you enjoy. And right off the bat, I completely believe this is what Dolly Parton smells like. I really do. I'm gonna go more into detail, but just at very first sniff, what you get is kind of a Barbie, plasticky, makeup type smell. And you know she's all about her makeup and big hair. <laughs> uh, it's very powdery and also very sweet. So, that sweetness to me at first kind of smells like a natural floral sweetness. I get personally ylang ylang. That's like the interpretation I get of it. It's not actually one of the notes. So it might be one of the other notes in here that I'm getting. It could be the peony. Um, but yeah, it's floral and powdery and sweet in the opening. So very makeup inspired. But then deeper in the dry down, it starts to smell rather vintage in a good way, not old fashioned necessarily, but vintage inspired. So it smells like very soft florals. And actually, if you've heard of the perfume Guerlain's Insolence, which was supposed to be um, candied violets or like candied violet petals, it reminds me of that kind of interpretation, like a candied floral petal smell. So sweet, powdery, but in a really natural floral way. And I would say compared to Guerlain's Insolence, I actually like this better because I found that to be a little bit too strong and too screechy for me after a while. This does not wear on me in the same way. So this is really gorgeous in a vintagey way. It's not super modern. It's not like you've never smelled anything like this before. Uh, actually, what it reminds me most of especially in the dry down, is Delina Exclusive. It's powdery, it's creamy, but still floral. It doesn't have the sharpness that Delina Exclusive is accented by, but it has the other elements. So yeah, this is actually really gorgeous. Um, it's overall just really a lot like Dolly, very comforting and soft and easy on the nose, easy on people around you. But also because of that, it doesn't have really great performance. The projection lasts for a very short time, then it becomes a skin scent. It also um, only lasted on me for about four or five hours before I had to respray, before it was pretty much gone from my skin. 
And as it does stay on my skin, so after the first hour, it does get sweeter and sweeter. So if you like your florals sweet, which I definitely do, and you also like the idea of something ladylike and powdery and soft and gentle, this would be actually a really great fit for you. Uh, but again, it is actually quite sweet in the dry down. So would I buy a full bottle of this? Well, it depends on the price. This is not really falling into the niche category. It's, it is still a celebrity scent, especially the performance really reveals that about it, that it's not quite like a designer quality perfume, but the scent itself is really gorgeous. It's so easy to wear, it's so comforting. And even though it has a vintage appeal, it does not have a grandma scent to it. And I think that the sweetness in it, which is people are more into sweet, sweet perfumes now than I think they used to be, that brings it up into the new generation and very appropriate for, I believe, any age, actually. I can see my mom wearing this. I can see me wearing this. I could also see um, a very sophisticated woman in college wearing this. I think it is gorgeous. So I will buy a full bottle of this if it is reasonably priced because it's not breaking down any walls, but it's a lovely daily go-to perfume. And again, that is Dolly Parton's new Eau de Parfum scent from above. So thank you for being here, for listening to this review. Let me know if you had a chance to test this out yourself. Again, I got mine on scentbeauty.com and I think it was $10 for a three milliliter bottle. So this is probably gonna last me for a few days since I overspray and with this one you particularly have to overspray. So let me know if you've had a chance to try it and what you think and let me know what you think about Dolly. It's all love here. I, I love Dolly, I love country music. I think she's fantastic and I love what she does for the world and I think she just has a, a really beautiful spirit. So I'm very excited to support her by purchasing this perfume as well. So thank you for being here. Hope this was helpful for you. Please be sure to like and subscribe and I hope you have a very beautiful